Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will likely skip a traditional British name for their newborn, and this is the reason why. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are anticipating the arrival of their baby, with just a few weeks to go before Meghan gives birth. Meghan, who is around eight months pregnant, will give birth around end of April to beginning of May. As the royals prepare to become first-time parents, punters have placed bets on the newborn's name including traditional favorites such as Diana and Arthur. However, new research says the royal couple will be unlikely opt for a traditional British name because of Meghan's American influence. Meghan, who is known for strain from royal protocol, may opt for an unconventional baby name and shy away from traditional British one, according to Nametag's research director. Research by Nametag's compiled information from international baby naming websites and communities, and found that some people refrain from certain baby names because of the way they sound in an American accent. Lars B. Anderson, managing director at My Name Tags, said, We supply name tags to children across the world and so see firsthand the huge influence that different cultures have on child names. Each country has a different set of trends and sociological factors that determine how and what they name their children. This got us thinking about the name of the royal baby, the fact that bookies were backing only traditionally British names, and the influence Meghan's nationality will have on the choice of name. Therefore, Meghan and Harry may choose a name that is both universally accepted and correctly pronounced in both British and American accents. Dr. Jane Pilcher an associate professor of sociology at Nottingham Trent University and leading authority on the sociology of names, said, Culture plays a vital role in the perception of certain names, the names that are popular or unpopular in different countries and, ultimately, what we choose to name our children. As this will be the first royal baby to have both British and American parentage, I would be surprised if Harry and Meghan agree on a name that we would expect, or that's quintessentially British. They will need to choose a name that is suitable for royalty, but they also have the added challenge of it being accepted and correctly pronounced among both the UK and US public. While Harry is the second most popular name for boys in the UK, the name does not make top 50 in the US. According to bookmakers, Meghan and Harry will most likely choose the name Diana, the name of Harry's late mother, with odds of 3-1. Meanwhile, the name Arthur is given odds of 12-1, and James has odds of 14-1. Other popular names include Victoria, Alice, Isabella, and Edward. The name Diana is highly popular in the UK, but is 230th most selected girl name in the US. Commenting on the prediction, Dr. Pilcher said, Nowadays, babies are rarely named after very close relations. Instead, it may be that a close family member is honored by choosing their name as a middle name. The exception is when a parent has passed away. 